Hello all you awesome people out there, my name is Kiro and welcome back to this let's play of Conscience Break. And we are kicking off where we left off last time by following our brothers and do what he tells us for some reason. Right. Through here. Okay. So yeah, we are just into the action already. You can't risk helping them. I know what happens if I don't and it'll still happen, Jack. I meant what I said back there. And there are no exceptions. If you get sucked into trying to change what can't be changed, it may cost us everything. Please, Jack. Our future depends on this. Okay. You said Monarch had the countermeasure this whole time. How? Why? Paul was using it to fuel some kind of messed up survival program. Uh -huh. They must have somehow repurposed it as a localized Cronon field regulator. I have no clue what you just said. and Dr. Kim both took positions at Monarch. Now I think I understand why. I think I've been through here. Oh right, that's the door kicked in. Beth Wilder who had the countermeasure, keeping it safe. She was the one who warned me, told me to build it. I know. You met her. Is she helping us? She was. Ah, I see. Yeah. Come on, this place isn't safe. There is something over here. We're outside. This would be over there somewhere, so can't yeah. stop here. Sorry. I am looking for treasure. Oh shit, watch out. <sighs> well, hey. Go this way now. Well, Okay, now we're fucking things up again. Or not. It's actually funny that I'm stuck in time right now. Uh, because I don't normally use it. Uh, end up doing that when the Chrome's fear of, oh, not Chrome's fear, the shadow comes around. And there we go. I didn't fight the thing. Oh man. I actually hope they give me control over my character for some reason. But um, they didn't apparently, so now we are screwed again. Or not. It just irritates me sometimes when I want to get the collectibles and do that. But Act 5, Part 3, Final Moments. So are we nearing the end of the game? Question mark? I really hope not for some reason because I actually enjoy this game. Um, even if I die a lot because I'm not that good at it, apparently, but I really enjoy it. So... Yeah. Load the screen, please stop so we can continue this adventure here. It'll take it forever for some reason this time. Please? Thank you. And there we are. Look, I know I've kept you in the dark. But when 
I started my work, you were so young, and afterwards, I always hoped it would all pass you by without touching you. Yeah. What? I get it. Come on. Let's just go to the future and fix this mess. Okay, I couldn't do anything there, but... I want this thing. Okay, there's only two in this All right. level here, so that should be fairly easy to find everything. And... Hey, brother. Come on, let's... Um... Wait a second. Okay. Where did you get an... Oh, you had a spare key, maybe. Reception. There. It's locked. You hid the machine here. You really never used it yourself? No, I didn't dare. Not after the man came out. It was Paul. He tried to kill me. Well, that, um... That is not good. <clears throat> You're doing it wrong. Rusted shut. Jack, a hand? Okay. And three, two, one, and go. One more time. One more time. <laughs> I just said that. When Monarch came for the time machine at the university, Paul was trapped in it. He escaped into the future. Whatever happened to him there changed him. Just a little bit. Somehow yes. I found my machine there. I used it to come back to 1990. I'll get in there, put his in there. Monarch. He escaped from Monarch and became what he escaped from. Insanity. I never should have built the machine. I should have left well enough alone. Thank right. you. That's it. And there we go. Just the way I left it. Hope it still works. Yeah. All right. We'll go to the future. A little after your time of departure. Before the fracture to stop time permanently. I don't know. I'm a little concerned about this. It'll be dangerous. Of course it'll be dangerous. At this point, what isn't? But I have been curious to try this. This is fun. Wow. So this is what it looks like. Yeah, come on. Walk forward, brother. Hey, Jack, you. When we exit, it'll be a little past the point you were at when you left to save me. That's our window. When we know it can work. Before time actually ends for good. It may not be much of a window. Monarch was sure it was imminent. Huh. Like they're experts. They kind of are. Maybe. All they know they stole from me. You worry about your end. I'll worry about mine. All right, well. That works. This is amazing. All those years. I never imagined that it would be like this. What the? Crap. Hang on, Will. Uh Okay. Okay, I can't hardly remember any buttons right now. Okay. <laughs> I can't remember how to fight. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, we try that one more time. That was a big mistake from my part. Okay, ready for the shot, and then...
fajn. Okay, much better than before. I don't know what um, went wrong there. We don't have time for this. Okay. So, Willy boy, come on. We have to go. We can't just be trapped in time like that. <laughs> I really like the ragdoll physics when you walk into them after you have killed them. It's like, me, blah, blah, blah. Okay, where the fuck do I have to go? Will, where are you? Over there. What? Okay, so the time machine is that thing. We came out from. I'm pretty sure I went this way. Must have killed people here. Then we really went all the way around. Apparently so. Hello. Okay, come on, brother. We ha you can't just stay there. Come on. Better not, Jack. I don't know how Will managed to get here, but we're getting. This is bigger than the two of us. You know, time's about to stop for good. Yes, it is. Hence the lifeboat program. A bunch of desperate people sitting around in a bunker somewhere, waiting for the inevitable. Jesus, Paul. You stole the CFR, Jack. I stole it? And the plan depends on it. So... I'll take that back now, please. I can't do that. The hell? Oh. I tried that again. I couldn't see anyone. That's the only irritating thing, actually. I the only complaint I have about this game, in some form, that is the more damage um, you take, the harder it is to see what you're actually doing. Don't tell me. Was it really all the way around here and could just have done this? Better not, Jack. Fine. Let's try this again. I just skipped the cutscene because I don't want to watch that again. Hate those guys. What are you doing? There we go. One down. Two down. Why are you going cover? No, you didn't. What the fuck? Okay, I had no clue what was happening. And what to do. You can't just throw that at me. Okay, we need to try one more time.
Okay. So now that we have first part done, let's um, go in safe spot here. Let's see. Okay, I can see two guys down there. God, there's a lot of people. Ow! That was one. Two. Three. God, I can't see where the guys are. That's so frustrating. Shields down. Yeah, I know. Okay. Yes, that did something. Yeah, now I have to defeat the next best of people. I hate that. I just have to get my health back here. Okay, get away, get away, get away. One more there. Good thing I was already on the other way. No, 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 no. To shoot him again. It's vulnerable now. Yeah, I know. There we go. Oh, finally. That took way longer than I <laughs> it should have. Ow. 
health? Um, I think he might be dead. Because that much better doesn't seem good. Time has stopped. I'll have to hook up the countermeasure to the core. It's designed to hypersaturate the Maya Joyce field with proton particles. Okay. The time machine is like an amplifier. That'll cause a chain reaction and rejuvenate the field. It'll be a universal event. I'll take your word for it. Just make it happen. What do you need? The countermeasure's charge is low. We'll need a jolt of chronon particles. A jump start. That's you. Well, let's see if I can do that. He was not dead. I think I've seen the first, that thing actually. Was that not from the beginning? The countermeasure. It stitched time back together everywhere. <coughs> the destruction couldn't be undone. The lives we lost were real. But we fixed it. Jack. <sighs> Will. Clocks kept on ticking. Come on. Come on. <sighs> I think we just saved the universe. Yeah. Where's Paul? He's dead. It's gone. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Will, he was wrong about everything. Was he? Will. The countermeasure worked. Be good. One more question. Paul Serene's entire philosophy was that time is a set path and nothing can be changed. At the time, you obviously disagreed. But after everything you've seen and done, we need to know. What do you believe now? Was he right? Or is it possible to change things? I'll come back for you. That is a good question. But I'm pretty sure that um, he thinks that he can change things. So, but um, yeah, that is control break apparently. I would just um, skip the... Um, I will just see was there anything after the credits here, so I can jump them, it seems. So let's see. Or else we can. 
There's something. You've been very patient with us and very helpful. Thank you. Yeah, well, that patience is starting to wear pretty thin. Of course. Right outside. Mr. Joyce. Finally. Thought you wanted to talk, not get my life story. Well, you were at the heart of all of this. And you can understand our need to find out exactly what happened. I heard it's all being pinned on Paul. It's quite the feat. Paul Serene always danced to his own tune, you know that. He and his delusions did tremendous damage to Monarch. But we can still salvage this company. We could use a man like you. It's not the same Monarch you know, Mr. Joyce. Your exceptional qualities are obvious. And we both know you have certain needs our expertise could help with. We can help each other. Okay. Crossroad churches. So, was that it? Curious? Proceeds to play. Apparently, that's my way through this game. One of the solutions. I have no clue what all these calls. Um, you see, I have not discovered everything. But if I'm not mistaken, there are other ways to go through this game. Um, but I really don't know how, or when, or if I will do it, but um, but there's some chances I can do it in this game. But I will leave that up to you guys to find out. Um, that is my way around the game, this one, and come to this conclusion here. So, yeah, and... <laughs> but um, game-wise, I really enjoyed it, actually. Um, the battle system is a little hard. I don't know if it's because I didn't find all the collectibles. Uh, and part of my character, uh, especially the last part here, because even though you don't have to attack him two times, I think it was, <sighs> it's still irritating when you get to the final point and you have a hard time managing your health. You have to run from everything all the time, and then you just got shot and you had to start over all the time. Uh, I think I died four or five times in total in this part. Um, so that can be a little um, irritating at, uh, at some time. Um, that you don't have any safe spots or anything, and you, you have a hard time to managing your health. Um, I understand for a realistic point, you you can't see your health normally, uh, but it's still irritating when when that happens. Also, if you're hiding um, places um, when they came in, I was uh, the second wave of uh, people. I was hiding behind a pillar, and they knew exactly where I were uh, when they get in and just started shooting over at me. Um, I think the game needs to get treated, uh, tricked a little so you can actually hide from them and they try to find you instead of they just knowing where you are um, in the beginning. Uh, because if you think about, um, I think it's uh, uh, Uncharted games, um, th there you can, I haven't played them on my channel, but I have played them. But you can swing around in the environment and hide from the people and stealth kill uh, things. Um, I think this game could use... I, I would really like if that this game actually has had a stealth mechanic because you can hide from things uh, easily. And I think that will also give a whole nother view of the game so you can try to sneak your way into what you have to do instead of it's always being... Oh, we haven't seen you yet but we know exactly where you are now we're going to shoot you. Uh, type of situations. Um, I really hope for that. But uh, other than that, um, I actually enjoyed this game a lot. Um, the story is a little confusing at times, but you have to have some knowledge about what's going on. Uh, and I also like the idea about the time machine doesn't work. Like you can not go further back than the fir the time machine was built, and f uh, and vice versa. You can't go further for, uh, forward in time until the point where the time machine doesn't exist anymore. 
So I actually like that um, concept uh, because that's also what I believe if a time machine ever gets built. I believe that how it would work also because it do doesn't make sense that you could go further back in time um, if there isn't a time machine that can manifest you there. But um, that's just my opinion on how time machines should work. Um, but yeah, I highly recommend people picking up this game and playing it for themselves. Um, because it is a really good game, except for that bad of mechanic, um, it is a little stupid. But that's a, a, as again, it's just my opinion on on that. Uh, some other people may be really good at this. I'm just I'm actually bad at shooters in t in the beginning, so that's why maybe. But um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this episode. I think I've been enough here. So if you enjoyed it, you can give it a thumb up. You can write a comment down below. You can subscribe for more videos, and I hope you all will have an awesome day. So until next time, farewell.